Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Mariah Nicole here. I am bringing you a new video today. So it's going to be a what's in my bag video. I'm going to show you the ins and outs of my new bag that I just purchased about three months ago. It's um, my Louis Vuitton bag. Um, this bag is literally my pride and joy. It's my firstborn, my first luxury bag that I purchased on my own. And I'm just so proud um, like to have like the uniqueness of it. I mean, of course I've seen this bag plenty of times um on a lot of people because it is a popular bag but i think i just did a little bit of a different touch like you know incorporating the scarf instead of the normal strap that it comes with so i just think my bag is like a little bit unique than the others but um if you guys want to see what's in my new bag um let's stay tuned and let's get started with the video me see what's in here okay so um when I did purchase this bag Louis Vuitton did give me like perfume samples so I keep it in the little box that it came with here Ooh, it's about to fall so I keep it in the Louis Vuitton box and it's like three different perfume sprays I haven't used it all because I'm not like a perfume person so I haven't really like used them all but I know it's like three different scents I know with like one bottle these the bottle of perfumes at Louis Vuitton are very expensive so I just like try to cherish the like four basically the four little testers that they gave me um let me of course they're in French well no okay so then one of them is Rose Des Vents. So this is one of the scents. And then another one is California Dream, which is this one here. And then we have another one called uh Har okay, I am bad with names. Don't even let me tell you what this is, but it's another one right here. I'll list down below the four perfumes that it is, and then it's another one. I can't pronounce the word, but they all pretty much smell good like one smells like a boy you know like one's more earthy one's more flowery um i think it's good to have these in your bag just in case um you know you do need to spray something on yourself you know with the little testers this is easy to on the go when you're traveling and everything of that sort so i just keep it in the bag that the box that they did originally give me um this box is so cute because at first when i did purchase the bag i didn't even receive a box for my purse so i was like oh look at the only louis vuitton bag that i, <laughs> that I have um this little tiny box i can't fit anything but it's okay i do love this and i just keep it in my box i mean in my bag so another thing would be deodorant Everybody knows, you know, just in case you are running late and you forget to like put that deodorant. I know there's a lot of people who might forget sometimes or if you want a little bit of refresher, having deodorant in your um, in your bag is always essential. So I went ahead and had that in there. And of course, I have this wallet. If you guys seen this wallet before, um, I've had it for a long time. I purchased it from Target like a few years years back i don't even remember how long i've had this um wallet for no name brand no nothing it's um but it does keep a lot of my cards like i said i do not have that much stuff in here so it's not organized or anything of that sort so i just throw this in here half of the time i would just throw my cards and stuff in my purse but now i'm trying to be a little bit more organized um so i do have next i do have two pair of sunglasses i have these frames they are pretty dirty i haven't worn them in a while and then i have the skinny frames which i've had forever i bought these from the pasadena flea market that we have at the rose bowl um a few years back so i don't have a name or a link to these glasses but let me just go ahead and try them on let me wipe them off they are pretty dirty so these are the first pair they're like kind of crooked <laughs> I think because they've been sitting in my bag for so long and I'm not like a glasses person either so I'm like why do I even buy half of this stuff because like I don't really like glasses I don't like how it messes up the makeup and all that stuff um, and then these are the other pairs these are the skinny pairs remember when skinny glasses were like really in I think like normal glasses are coming back so like it's not as popular but let me just go ahead and then I have these 
these black ones here. These are still always cute. I love these. Even though they don't really protect your eyes, but they really are a fashion statement. So I have these as well. Okay. And then I have my work badge to get into my job. Basically, that is always has to stay in my bag because, of course, that's the way to get in there. Um, I also have masks. You know, the mask is essential now. Like, we can't go anywhere without it. So, I try to keep one in my purse at all times. Then, I have my... Oh, I gotta dig deep. This bag is, like, pretty big. Um, I have my AirPods. Always on the go. You always need to have these, like whenever you need a moment to be yourself or listening to music on your own or you know have your earphones to talk to people and then of course my keys of course that stays in there i also have a copy of my insurance just so i don't have to look in the glove department you know i can just look in my purse and it's easy access so have this ready for me then I'm the type of person who, when I'm ready to take stuff off, I will just take it off in the drop of the dime. So I have earrings in here, you know. I always say, like, where are my earrings? And then I forget that they're always in my bag, so I think I thought I lost them. So, you know, that's the problem of um, with me just, like, letting everything just come off at one time. Let me tell you guys. <laughs> I don't have small little compacts of freaking lotion and I feel like I'm always rushing the house you know like when you wash your hands so much you need lotion at all times now um so I have this big old thing of lotion <laughs> this big thing of lotion in my purse yes it does kind of stain it I have to like put a paper towel over it because you know sometimes when you squeeze too much it leaves like residue at the top of the knob here so this is um hand and body cream made with moroccan argan oil from trader joe's it's a trader joe's brand um i have i put like a little bit of drops in here because it was like kind of like a smell to it so i put i mean yeah you know it does smell like moroccan oil but i did want a little bit of like mm to it you know when i'm putting it on my hands i want to be like ooh, it smells good um i put like essential oils in here like tea tree oil and some other oils just to make it smell a little bit better but yes essential with a big jug of lotion so i never run out <laughs> um so let me go ahead and see what else is in here i have a big thing of hand sanitizer as well um i just use this but this bottle but this used to be like an alcohol hand cleanser but now i just put like we have like a big jug of hand sanitizer. I just like refill this and then I just use it throughout the day. So this is another essential now that it's COVID-19. We all know. Um, keep those germs away. So then um, I have one more thing in this bag. And then I'll show you like how it looks inside. So I have a makeup bag, of course, with like my essentials, like lip glosses, my compact you know just to do those touch-ups um chapstick you know um what is it i even have lash glue just in case i need to put lashes on the go i only really um put lashes on if i am going to take a photo or i'm filming like today um i really like my real lashes so I don't really like to deal with these fake lashes and sometimes it's hard to put on and I don't I refuse I refuse to get um lash instinction because no <laughs> I don't like to have to refill and do like all that extra work so I don't even like going to the nail shop you guys so I couldn't even maintain doing the lashes but um I did want to show you how the bag looks and if you are looking to get a new bag and you're a person who has a lot of stuff this bag is perfect for you so in the inside it's huge like it's really huge it's like um 
a lot of space and then in the middle of the bag there is like a small compartment oh, well if you can tell there's like a small compartment in the middle where you like you can put your change you know like of course if you had money or something you could store it in there as well and um yeah it's just like a nice size bag i think that you know you can dress it up you can dress it down i love that um the strap is not like super long you know on the handle it's not like really long so it's just like basically like cups let me just show you like this it, like stops like right here at the edge of your like basically yeah, not even mid thigh like a little bit of your thigh area so like it's there and then it keeps the shape so i like a bag that keeps the shape especially because i don't have a lot of stuff in it so it looks like it's stuff in here but obviously it's not that much stuff because like how you can tell i didn't have that much stuff in the bag so i just enjoy everything about it you know um the only thing i wish is that it did zip all the way but like i said um with using this strap here i can like tighten it so like you know just people aren't just grabbing inside of my bag but other than that this bag is beautiful i feel like it's timeless of course with this um the mono monogram um look it's always classic and timeless like it will forever be like in style so i did get the scarf the scarf was separate it was um like at first i was like i don't know because i really wanted a shoulder bag like like i said shoulder bags are in at the moment and i was tired of the crossbody like my shoulders would hurt sometimes with all the weight from the bags so i just wanted just a regular shoulder bag and i was just like debating between this bag and like the dior bag but the dior bag is so small the saddle bag um i just didn't think it was worth three thousand dollars and it's not worth three thousand dollars so i just um i just said that this would be more practical and like i said it is timeless and i can use it all the time like if i needed to put like extra stuff in here i'll fit and i don't have to worry so like you see i can put my whole big thing of lotion in here i know i can put bottles and stuff like whenever i need it so i did love this bag and um i like that the salesperson did recommend doing the scarf like i mentioned before and once you put it on there i was like i'm sold this is my bag this is the bag of my dreams and um i'm just so fortunate i am grateful and fortunate that i was able to purchase this on my own this video is not bragging i didn't want to come you know basically come on here just bragging about my bag but i am proud of it and hopefully one day i can purchase another bag and if you guys like this video go ahead and um like it comment and subscribe to my channel and also i have joined tiktok <laughs> i don't know what i'm thinking of right now but i just wanted to start doing real videos and i've been seeing how people have been getting the sounds and everything from tiktok so i was just like you might you might as well just post on there and post on instagram with the real videos so um go ahead and follow me on there both my instagram is marine underscore nicole with two e's and it is a nicole with a k instead of a c and then also my tiktok is the same way mariah underscore nicole go ahead and follow me on there and then of course let me know down below what videos you guys want to see i do want to give you guys what you want to see i'm thinking about another haul video but i just don't know what store to purchase from just yet as i'm looking online i'm just trying to see like how long the shipping is going to take because of course I want to film it right away so just let me know down below and if you guys want to see more videos of me please 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 subscribe and then thank you so much for watching this video and hanging in there with me and I hope to see you guys in the in the next one bye